There is a science to predicting the weather, but even the most accurate estimations will have a hard time predicting it accurately for more than three days. Before satellite images and long-term studies came into practice, farmers had their own ways of predicting. Did you know that you can get an accurate temperature reading by counting cricket chirps? A scientific study from 2007 confirmed that counting the chirps in a 13 second interval and adding 40 to it will pretty much match the temperature degrees in Fahrenheit exactly. More than 96 million people turn on the Weather Channel every day and the station employs over 80 full-time meteorologists. However, studying the science doesn't necessarily mean you'll end up in front of a blue screen. Most graduates actually end up working for the government and various universities. So here's our question. What is the scientific name for studying weather?